Giovanni? Hi there, we great result and performance today overall. Thought it was very good. In the last couple of games, even though we spoke after Dundee United about maybe being a bit fragile in result over overall being 2-1, there was a lot of chances created. Last week, a lot of chances created. Again today, a lot of chances created. Seems like the team have got their swagger back in, the, in attack. Is that something you would agree with? And are you pleased about how they're looking in attack now? Yeah, I think it's, <clears throat> and of course, you know, you need... To, you need the points every every uh, every game, but you know I think we're the intention we had today is is I think made the difference in 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 trying to uh, uh, get the first goal really early in the game. You know we were you know started really well, good goal from from Antonio the first one, and of course the second penalty we were tuned up, which will make it a lot easier uh, for uh, for the team in in the in the remaining minutes of the of the game, but. I think you know the performance in the second half was better because we dominated more. We we played be much better uh, possession game the second half to create even more chances and until you know even in the end you know we were trying to to go forward and and keep the energy in in uh, in the game, keep the pace in the game, and um, that was for me very positive from uh, from today. You know. Put energy in, make runs. You know, try to create as many chances as possible. And um, you saw that today, but you also saw that in uh, at, at, at Hearts last week. Uh, congratulations, Giovanni! Excellent performance and result. Defensively, the team over the last two league matches and even on uh, Tuesday night at Anfield looks a lot more solid. Is that the players, the new players settling in and getting to know each other, such as Ben Davis and Leon King's coming on as well? And you've been able to have some stability back there that maybe you didn't have with injuries, etc. Earlier in the season. Yeah, we had. You know, we have much more um, players to pick from. Of course, you know Ben. Uh, is the one who uh, who wasn't able uh, to play in the beginning of the season. He's getting stronger and stronger. I think his performance on the, in the midweek was positive. Today again, positive. You know, so it's uh, it's good to have him. You know, at uh, at, at full strength. Uh, Leon came in and was you know again like he showed on on midweek, very decent, very controlled. So it's um, you know it's I think they are the. Um, the, the 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 working together as a back line together with with the team is is getting better and uh, you know you cannot switch off and that's uh, and that's what they did today because you know they're third in the league and had very good results so I think the approach we had was very positive and uh, that's why we we won the game kept the clean sheet and uh, you know could change also uh, players who came in and had also a positive uh, positive performance. Well, I'm really happy because the more options, the better for me. Uh, fashion, you know, he uh, he had some really good uh, uh, subs, you know, especially in in midweek. He uh, he came in really well against Hearts as well. So. You know, we wanted to give him uh, the chance to to play from the beginning, and uh, I think he was he was uh, really good. You know, he did what we expected, and uh, you know, if you use your speed, you know, I think the the biggest improvement we have is that we uh, we are able now to use the speed we have up front, and that um, in 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 the last couple of weeks, you know, we didn't do that as well as we did the last couple of games against Hearts and 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 today and. Uh, it makes it so much easier for the team when there is threat always up front, and I think of both uh, wingers today, and even with the chains with with Ryan, we we, we had that. There was a bit of talk just in the summer about Sakala's future, whether he could maybe go out. Was that come close to you know him leaving the club, and is today showing why you think he's going to the club? No, we I I never um, uh, we never wanted to to fashion to leave. Of course, you know he was talking about his future like like all the players, but uh, you know it was never my intention to to let fashion go. Giovanni, it's always a big risk when you make five changes to the starting lineup. How happy are you that it paid off, and how happy are you with the urgency that the new guys brought to the team? Well, it's it's five changes from midweek, but only one change from the Hearts game. It's just totally same lineup. Only we we changed the uh, Robbie for uh, uh, Fashion for for Ryan. So it was a team who played already together last week. So 
in that uh, in that light, it wasn't a big risk for me, and and they showed that today as well. You know, we we have to switch, uh, you know, from from different competition. Of course, the Champions League being the in the most uh, um, uh, difficult, but uh, I think the momentum we have in the league, you know, is very positive, and we we have to keep that. Giovanni, just tell us a bit about Antonio Cholai's performance today. Another two goals, and when you brought him in in the summer, did you expect him to, to hit the ground running so soon? I think it's 13 already this season. Yeah, well, uh, of course we uh, we wanted wanted him to have a have a, have a good start because we. We, I was happy that we had him really early in preseason because we knew, of course, Morelos wasn't uh, uh, ready for the beginning of the campaign, and of course, with the Champions League qualifiers already uh, really early in the season, I think he uh, he had to uh, perform really well from the beginning, which which he did, and uh, I'm very happy with his uh, with his performances and. Uh, you know, all he has to do now is keep continuing and 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 keep the, giving uh, the team the performances he did today. Josh, Giovanni, just ask you about James Tavernier. Obviously, he played a little bit more central today. We've seen that last season with with Sakala away. What does he give you when he's in that slightly different role? And is that something we'll see more kind of going forward? Well, you know, normally we we have some some. Um, Different approaches to to play against uh, a team who plays really uh, really deep with with five defenders. Today I decided to to play with two natural wingers with with one against one uh, possibilities and and speed. So for for Tab was a bit different, but you can still see, you know, we wanted him to come in positions uh, to uh, to shoot on goal as well, and and he had a couple of in the first half, second half as well. So it's a bit different, but still we can. Uh, he can come in his strength and keep the crosses in, and uh, so yeah, I think it was very positive uh, um, the way the way he played. A little bit different, like he normally uh, does, but you know, I think the the role he had today, he can he can do uh, really well as well. Giovanni, uh, obviously the plaudits today will probably go to the likes of Antonio Cholak and uh, Fashion Sakala, but I thought Ryan Jack had a very strong performance in midfield. Uh, what were your thoughts on his performance today and is he now um, pushing for a starting place on Wednesday night? Well, he's, he's had a very positive, uh, part of the positive game. You know, I think he uh, he put energy in the game like we wanted. You know, we, we know the way he plays, very strong on the ball. Very, uh, uh, very aggressive as well in in, in in moments we need. So for me, a uh, very good performance, uh, as you said. And uh, I think a lot of players showed uh, with their performances they want to play on Wednesday, and and Ryan is is is, is one of them.